The Derby Child Sex Abuse Ring was a group of men who sexually abused up to 100 girls in Derby, England, in 2010, after an undercover investigation by Derbyshire Police. Members of the ring were charged with 75 offenses relating to 26 girls. Nine of the 13 accused were convicted of grooming and raping girls between 12 and 18 years old. The attacks provoked fierce discussion about race and sexual exploitation. The 13 men lived throughout Derby and the police believed they met through a shared attraction for young girls. The leaders were Abid Muhammad Sadiq and Muhammad Roman Liaquat. Both married men with young children. They would cruise around the streets of Derby targeting young girls. CCTV footage showed the gang leaders making repeated efforts to entice a pair of girls standing by the side of the road into their car. The police later discovered vodka and plastic cups under the car seats. Sadiq was accused of having sexual activity with a 12-year-old in Darley Park. And Liaquat had sex with a 14-year-old in their vehicle. The victims aged between 12 and 18 were predominantly vulnerable girls from troubled backgrounds. And some of them were in care and known to social services. The men would target girls at railway stations on estates and walking home from school. The gang would first befriend the girls, inviting them out for a drive or a drink and supplied them with alcohol and drugs. The grooming process was then intensified. The girls were invited to parties and further meetings were arranged. The girls were then driven to secluded areas and were sexually abused and raped. The abuse took place in houses and hotels across the Midlands, parks and even the victims' own homes. Two victims were threatened with hammers while another was locked up before being raped. Sometimes up to six men would be involved in the often violent assaults, which the gang would film on their mobile phones. Three gang members were filmed having sex with a 14-year-old girl in a hotel room to the sound of noisy cheering. One, some of the girls were locked up to prevent them escaping. A 16-year-old victim stated, I will never ever understand what has made them so evil and ignorant that still to this day they think they've not done anything wrong. Derby police were aware of rumors of a pedophile gang operating in the city. On 30 December 2008, Staffordshire police stopped a car on suspicion of shoplifting, carrying three gang members and three young girls. The girls had been reported missing from a care home in Derby. The police drove the girls back to Derby, and during the journey, they told the officers about what had been taking place. Derbyshire police force launched an undercover investigation called Operation Retriever. Setting up surveillance and tailing the gang's BMW around Derby, detectives collected DNA samples from several of the crime scenes. Sadiq was wearing an electronic tag after a previous conviction for assaulting a woman. On the 24th of April 2009, two distressed teenagers stumbled out of a flat that was under surveillance and said that they had been raped. The police had been unaware of their presence. The victims told the police of other girls who had been assaulted and the police soon discovered a campaign of systematic grooming and abuse within the city. Detective Inspector of Derbyshire Police, Sean Dawson, said, When we arrested them, we had no idea of the scale of this. Once we had them locked up, other victims spoke out and it snowballed from there. Debbie Platt, who led the police investigation, said she was shocked at the extent of the abuse and said it was like a campaign of rape against children. The police stated that the abuse could have continued for a lot longer. The Crown Prosecution Service charged the gang with 75 charges relating to 26 girls, ranging from rape to intimidating witnesses, though police believed there were many more victims. The men were charged in three separate trials. Name conviction Abid Muhammad Sadiq raped sexual assault, sexual activity with a child, perverting the course of justice, aiding and abetting rape.
false imprisonment, making indecent images of children Muhammad Roman Liaqat rape, sexual assault, aiding and abetting rape, affray, sexual activity with a child. Making indecent images of children Akshay Kumar making indecent images of children Faisal Mahmood sexual activity with a child Muhammad Imran Rahman rape Graham Blackham breaches of sexual offender. Prevention order Abid Muhammad Sadiq was jailed for a minimum of 11 years. Muhammad Roman Liaqat for a minimum of 8 years. Three other men were jailed during the investigation, but for charges of perverting the court of justice and cocaine supply?